Hi guys, it's Miss Ellen from Hopes, and I'm not here with Jaden today, so I feel a little sad. Um, but let's do our feelings check in and see how you guys feel. Hmm, a lot of different feelings going on out there, right? Um, so we're going to continue reading from that series talking about our emotions and our behaviors. And today is not fair, won't share. And I think we've all felt like this at some point, maybe even today, maybe this week. But on Monday, Miss Clover had a surprise for everyone. She had made a space station. Oh my God, how cool does that sound? There were buttons to push. There were levers to pull. There were boots and a helmet to wear too. How do you think the kids feel about that? I think they are pretty excited, right? So I would guess everybody wants in on that action, right? Only three children could play at a time, right? Because we need to have space and get in there safely. But everyone wanted a turn because it's super cool. It's new. It's awesome. But then Miss Clover had a good idea. She put everyone's name in a hat. Right? So there's a sign that says three children only. Right? So it does look pretty cool there, right? She pulled out Nora's name first. Then she pulled out Dan's name second. And then she pulled out Henry's name third. So it sounds like they're all going to have to take turns going in there, right? Got to be patient and wait, which can be really hard. Um, Miss Clover said they could play first, but they had to take turns and share, right? So taking turns is I have it, you have it, I have it, you have it, or you have it, I have it, right? Um, and share. So if there's an outfit, we can take different parts, right? So she's telling them, here's how it's going to work, right? So the kids are all looking on. They're super excited when their names are called. Ooh, can't wait. Nora put on the boots and the helmet. She pushed all the buttons and she pulled all the levers. And she wouldn't let Dan or Henry take turns. Ooh, how do you think they felt like that? Yeah, I'd be upset too. She wouldn't let them wear the boots or the helmet. Oh my gosh, she is not sharing, nor is she taking turns with any of that. Look at their faces. What does that tell you? Yeah, like she looks worried that they're going to take it and he's grabbing his fist so he looks like he's really mad. They're frowning. Ooh, they're not happy about that. So Dan got mad. He said it wasn't fair, and that's right, but he pushed Nora hard. Ooh, that's not nice either, right? So she's not playing fair, but he's not either. Yeah, what he did was really mean, right? And Henry was looking on surprised, but then Henry got really mad too. He said it wasn't fair. He grabbed the helmet and he grabbed it right off of her head. Yeah, so everyone's making poor choices here, right? They're super angry and you guys remember what to do when we're angry. Let's see what they do. Nora then got very, very mad. She said it wasn't fair. She said she didn't want to share. Then Miss Clover got mad too. She sent them out of that space station, right? So everybody's really mad now. They didn't share, they did some mean stuff, push and grabbing, right, not sharing. And now Miss Clover's mad because these kids are ruining it for everyone. Nora went to the reading corner. She stopped feeling mad. Soon she stopped feeling mad. She wished she had taken turns and played with Henry and Dan. It's kind of like the cozy corner. Um, Right? Sometimes we need to retreat and go and chill for a minute and think about it. Dan went to the art corner. Soon he stopped feeling mad. He wished that he had not pushed Nora. Right? So like a cozy corner somewhere. Art is always so much fun to calm down. Like a lot of people like that. Right? So they're using those to calm down and reflect on that. That means think about what happened. Henry went on the computer. Soon he stopped feeling mad. He wished he had not grabbed the helmet. Miss Clover, she went and she counted to 10 slowly. Soon, she stopped feeling mad too, right? So we talk about that breathing that helps us. Looks like she did that. And Henry is chillaxing on the computer and that's making him feel a little bit better, right? So they all got rid of the angries. And you remember, we have lots of different ways to do that. So then Nora, Dan, and Henry, they all said, I'm sorry to each other and to Miss Clover too. And then Miss Clover let them have another turn at the space station. She told them to take turns and share. And do you think they'll do it this time? Now look at the three friends coming out of the space station. They're so happy. They were taking turns and sharing and they had a great time. And I'm glad Miss Clover is giving them, you know, we all make mistakes and Miss Clover is giving them another chance. So let's see what happens. They all took turns pushing the buttons. 
They all shared the helmet and the boots. They all took turns pulling the levers and they all had lots of fun. And this time, no one got mad at all. Look at those faces. They look so happy, they're smiling. They all look like they're getting along, they're laughing. Wow. So that's the end of that, right? So I want you guys to think about that for a bit. Think about all the different ways we can calm down or the things that we can do if we start to get angry. Um, you know, I love when Jaden normally does this one. So there's like a little bit of a different story at the end now. So I want you to tell the story of what happens with these two space creatures. They find a toy and they don't want to share. So the picture on top is they're both racing for that toy, right? Because they both want to get it. So they both look super happy there. But then what happens? Somebody gets to it first and the other person looks really angry. How do you know that one's angry? Yeah, the face, right? So one is frowning and looks really like mad and the other is smiling and bouncing it and looks really happy. But then what happens? How do you think when they didn't feel they didn't share the toy? Over here, the one on the top, the other one's trying to grab it, right? Because everybody wants to play with fun stuff, right? And what we can do is, oh, on the bottom, they've decided to play together and everybody looks, you got it, happy because they're smiling, right? So when we share, when we play fair, we all win, right? We all have a better time. So I know there's stuff, even adults like, like things and everybody wants a turn, um, but we need to share, take turns. Um, and in cases, let's see what we have here, right? So I'm sure there are times that you can think of where you didn't want to share something or something wasn't shared with you and how you felt. Maybe you did something that wasn't appropriate or maybe you chilled out, right? So I want you guys to remember the solution toolkit and we'll post that, right? So if somebody's bothering you, you can say, please stop, right? If you need something, you can um, get a timer, you can share, you can take turns, you can trade stuff, right? So there's a lot of different things that you can do there. So don't forget that solution toolkit. Um, and then if you get really angry, there's other stuff that you can do too to help yourself calm down. So they went to like a cozy corner, somebody went on the computer, somebody did art. Remember we've talked about like if you're really mad, you can like get some Play-Doh and squeeze it and that feels really good. Um, remember we made our angry dragon. So that helps us to take those deep breaths like the teacher did. So, <gasps> right, fire breathing dragon. We've got lots of different stuff, right? And we'll post those as well. And remember we had made our remote control. So maybe they could have paused and rewound and figured it out. And it sounds like they made a solution in the end. Again, you make a mistake, we apologize, but might do like need to do a tucker and take three deep breaths. And then remember you can take it in, hold it and let it out a couple times and then think, think, think about a solution. Use a solution toolkit. If you need to get out the angries, do something productive. Maybe it's blown bubbles, a pinwheel. Um, but it's really, really important that we be fair, right? So that means taking turns, that means sharing, right? And after we do that, we all feel better and we all have fun together, right? Because isn't that the point? We want to be together and have fun. So be fair and share. Um, keep us posted and stay well. Bye.